Hi and welcome back, it's Vicky here and today I'm going to showcase the March card kit by Simon Says Stamp. Now first let's take a quick look on what's included and then I'm going to share a card for inspiration. Now first of all in this kit you will get two different stamp sets. The first one is a 6x8 clear stamp set and it's called Amazing. It has a lot of sentiments that work uh, great for encouraging cards and motivational ones and it also comes with all those circles that work for creating lovely backgrounds, you can use them as fireworks or even as flowers. And you also get a smaller clear stamp set that's 3x4 and it's called Wooly Lucky. Lamas are trending and um, they are so cool to use on a card and uh, since I don't celebrate St. Patrick's Day I think I am going to make a card today for just sending a good luck to someone. Now let's take a look at what else is included. Since it is kind of a St. Patrick themes uh, day this um, kit you will get this uh, mix of sequins and um, in green color and also a little ink cube in green as well even the lollipop was green this time now you will also get this uh, sticker these are by Doodlebug these are really adorable and you get two of those pages so every sticker you have it twice now you'll also get three envelopes one of them the yellowish one is a uh, metallic I don't know if you can see the shimmer and uh, the other two are just plain white. You will also get a paper pad. These are 12 single sided uh, 6x6 papers and uh, they are by Lone Phone from the Really Rainbow collection. You get a lovely scallop design in different subtle colors. And finally you will get 6 different colors of cardstock for creating your card bases. So today I'm going to create a good luck card that can be used throughout the year for pretty much any occasion and not just for St. Patrick's Day. So for that I'm going to use a heart and I'm going to rotate it on this piece of cardstock. As I'm running it through my uh, big shot I am going to create kind of a leaf. So I don't know if that's the case with uh, every culture but at least in Greece you are considered very lucky if you find a clover with four leaves and that's exactly what I'm going to do here. So even though we don't celebrate uh, St. Patrick's Day I can totally use all these products to create such a card. Now the heart die doesn't come in the kit but I'm sure that if you look through your stars you will all have a tiny little heart that you can use to rotate it and cut it out four times to create this little clover. Now I wasn't going for the perfect placement, I was just eyeballing it, but if you want to make it completely symmetrical then just draw a cross and place your heart on top of the lines. Now I am going for a shaker card here, so I added some uh, foam tape at the back to create a little pocket and inside I'm adding the sequin mix that was included in the kit. I'm going to cover up the pack with a piece of gold cardstock that I have here and my shaker window is ready. I stamped the llama and colored it with my alcohol markers and in some areas such as the clovers I used my gold glitter pen to add some shine. Now I'm using my scissors and I'm going to cut all around the llama. This is uh, not so difficult if you leave a white border all around and this way I will be able to pop it on top of my card. Now I have all the elements ready to go so it's just a matter of putting everything together. I used uh, glue at the back of the shaker panel to stick it on top of my card base and now I have also cut out a little uh, thin strip of uh, gold cardstock. I'm gonna stick it down with glue and this is the stem of my clover. I also stamped the sentiment on a thin strip of uh, white cardstock. I'm going to stick that with uh, foam tape at the back. And then on top I'm going to stick my llama. Again for that I'm going to use foam tape at the back. And that finishes the card for today. I hope you had fun that you got inspired. There is a giveaway for this card kit on my blog so make sure to visit and enter the giveaway. Thank you all so much for watching today and have a lovely weekend.